StadiumDB.com presents MLS Stadiums Hello, today we are going to take a closer look at the stadiums that host MLS teams. This league has been around for more than a quarter of a century and along with it, the venues you are about to see have developed. We will present the arenas in order from the smallest to the largest. So, come and visit all 29 stadiums with us. Which of them can be called the American Dream? Find out for yourself. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Also, click the bell so you don't miss the next materials. And now, we move to California, specifically at PayPal Park, capacity 18,000. San Jose Earthquakes Due to its close proximity to Mineta Airport, the stadium has a low profile and an open north side. However, the compact auditorium produces a very good atmosphere, which the Quakes have enjoyed for many years. Dick's Sporting Goods Park Capacity 18,061 Colorado Rapids This is the highest-lying stadium of all in MLS. It is located approximately 1,600 meters above sea level. Opened in 2007, the home of the Rapids has been upgraded several times over the years, although these have not been significant redevelopments. Children's Mercy Park Capacity 18,467 Sporting Kansas City in addition to its distinctive blue roof, the Kansas City Stadium has been known for using its naming rights to promote health and fitness since opening in 2011. Subaru Park Capacity 18,500 Philadelphia Union It offers a stunning view of the Commodore Barry Bridge. The 10-year-old stadium remains one of the classic MLS venues with partial stand coverage. Finished in brick and stone, the stadium offers 30 luxury boxes along the pitch. DRV PNK Stadium Capacity 19,100 Inter Miami Created out of necessity, it replaced the famous Lockhart Stadium it set an international record for the time in which it was completed. The design and opening of the stadium were only nine months apart, thanks to its fully modular construction. Allianz Field Capacity 19,600 Minnesota United The smallest of the Allianz-sponsored stadiums, it opened in 2019 and immediately became an icon of the Minnesota Twin Cities. The $250 million facility even has its own microbrewery. An interesting feature is the extra-large analog clock that has been erected behind the spectators' backs in the north stand. This follows in the tradition of European scoreboards. Stad Saputo Capacity 19,619 CF Montreal The Montreal team moved to the more intimate Stad Saputo from the Olympic Stadium. In 2011, a decision was made to expand the facility, making it MLS compliant. Audi Field Capacity 20,000 DC United Worth $195 million, it can pride itself on its high sustainability standards and seats only 2.5 meters from the pitch. From February 2017, it took only about 500 days to deliver a full product, ready for the first match which took place on July 14, 2018. Lower.com Field Capacity 2011 Columbus Crew The Columbus Crew moved to the stadium near the city center from the historic northern outskirts. Match day at the relatively new stadium is now more attractive, providing a fantastic terrace for fans and beer gardens. America First Field Capacity 20,213 Real Salt Lake 
Known for its undulating roof, the stadium in Salt Lake City has hardly changed since its opening in 2008. However, it is no longer called Rio Tinto Stadium as of September 10, 2022. Toyota Stadium Capacity 20,500 FC Dallas Located north of Dallas, the stadium opened in 2005 with 17 training pitches. Since then, the southern section has been renovated, roofed over and has become home to the National Soccer Hall of Fame organization. Q2 Stadium Capacity 20,738 Austin FC Debuting in 2021, Austin's first football stadium has a sloping roof that is both beautiful to look at and improves acoustics. The building is also capable of hosting many other events, apart from soccer matches. Bank of California Stadium Capacity 22,000 Los Angeles FC LAFC's home has become the little brother of the nearby Coliseum. Covered in translucent ETFE plastic, it emerged as a new landmark on the US stadium map when it opened in 2018. PNC Stadium Capacity 22,039 Houston Dynamo Combining the best of European and American stadium solutions, the venue is compact, practical and showcases impressive architecture, which was not very common among MLS venues in 2012. City Park Capacity 22,500 St. Louis City SC after several unsuccessful attempts to create a soccer team in St. Louis that could participate in MLS, a new development initiative was created in the autumn of 2018. In designing the stadium, special care was taken to ensure that spectators were as close to the pitch events as possible. You too can be as close to the events as possible, this time on our channel. So we encourage more than 95% of our viewers to subscribe. Leave a thumbs up too. Don't forget to comment. Thank you for your support. Red Bull Arena. Capacity 25,189. New York Red Bulls. When it was built in 2010, some fans were unsure about the fully covered auditorium. At the time, New Jersey's home pitch was more European than any other MLS venue. Providence Park, capacity 25,218, Portland Timbers Known for its noisy fans and sold-out tickets to Portland Timbers games, the stadium has recently been expanded and now includes a massive multi-level East stand. Exploria Stadium Capacity 25,500 Orlando City Already during construction, Orlando City's popularity led to the expansion of the works. When it opened in 2017, the combination of steep stands and safe standing areas created a great atmosphere. TQL Stadium Capacity 26,000 FC Cincinnati this is the first MLS stadium to offer a fully LED facade. The Cincinnati facility is another testament to the league's popularity. It too had to be expanded before it even opened its doors to fans. Dignity Health Sports Park Capacity 27,000 Los Angeles Galaxy This is one of the oldest stadiums in MLS. It has seen numerous upgrades in recent years, worth more than $35 million since 2014. The facility cost $130 million to build and the first match was played in June 2003. Geodis Park Capacity 30,000 Nashville SC In 2020, the Nashville team joined the MLS competition. Among other things, the team took over the name and colors of Nashville SC, a club playing in the USL Championship since 2018. The first level of the stands was based on the slopes around the pitch, 
which is located in a small basin below the level of the surrounding ground. BMO field Capacity 30,991 Toronto FC Toronto FC's home is also Canada's national football stadium. The popularity of the sport led to its capacity being increased to 30,000 in 2016, after less than a decade of operation. Yankee Stadium Capacity 49,642 New York City FC A baseball stadium is certainly not an ideal venue for soccer. However, in the New York City landscape it is some solution, especially as the Yankees and NYCFC share ownership. Besides, it is $1.5 billion stadium built quite recently, in 2009. BC Place Capacity 54,500 Vancouver White Cups After being converted to a retractable roof stadium, the Vancouver venue became the first arena to use curtains that mimic a canopy. This makes the stands appear more full when only part of them are open. Soldier Field Capacity 63,500 Chicago Fire The exterior walls of the building are done in the Greco-Roman style, referencing ancient architecture with, among other things, Doric columns. After a very unsatisfactory lease at Bridgeview, the Chicago Fire have reintroduced themselves as a brand on the large football pitch near the city centre. Their return to Soldier Field could have been an amazing event if not for the pandemic. Gillette Stadium, capacity 65,878, New England Revolution. The New England Revolution are a team that did not move to a purpose-built stadium. The giant facility in Foxborough that also serves the NFL team is more than adequate, especially after its upgrade in 2010. Lumen Field Capacity 68,740 Seattle Sounders Although built as an NFL venue, it has proven to be a great home for the Sounders, putting the team at the top of the MLS League in terms of attendance, with an average of more than 40,000 fans per game. The stadium has a partially open north side, allowing views of the business district skyline from inside. Mercedes-Benz Stadium Capacity 71,000 Atlanta United the design of the stadium was dubbed the Pantheon. The dome loosely follows the Roman origin in function, with the world's first roof consisting of eight panels and acting as a camera shutter. It was this vision that was chosen as the winning one. Initially, Atlanta United was to play at less than half capacity, but the team proved to be very popular. Of the ten most attended regular season matches in history, all were played here, and almost every one attracted more than 70,000 people. Bank of America Stadium Capacity 74,867 Charlotte The club began MLS play in the 2022 season as the league's 28th franchise. Charlotte FC shares the facility with the Carolina Panthers of the NFL, for most soccer games, the stadium's capacity is reduced to 38,000. In 2004, the naming rights were acquired by Bank of America for up to 20 years. We have now reached the largest of the venues where American clubs play matches in the increasingly popular MLS. Ahead of us, however, more material awaits you not only here, but also on our StadiumDB.com website and on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. You will find it all in the description. See you!